Hello, welcome to Wine Vault TV, New Zealand's most passionate wine program. And today we're actually in store with Giapo, Jean Paulo. Yes. And here he is there. And what we're going to do is we're going to teach you or show you the process in which we're going to, the process we're using to make our Sauvignon Sorbet. Fantastic. So no, the, the process is pretty simple. We're using only three ingredients. We're we'll wearing water. My muscle. He rolled his sleeves up earlier to show us his big guns. So. And I don't know what that was for, whether it was just to outmuscle me or not. But uh, why water? Why why the water? We need the water because sorbet is made out of water, sugar, and wine. We need the water to for the mix. Right. Okay. Okay. And then this we have is a beautiful the crossings, crossings from our tree valley in uh, Marlborough. Yes. Yes. Sh right off the bat, we get kind of like a lot of tropical kind of fruit, passion fruit, melon. But I'm not sure whether this will translate into what we get out of the sor sorbet. It's quite dry and there's a, a kind of a bit of sweetness right Again. at the end. Um, it is on that tropical fruit side of things. Um, this would be the most interesting thing because we've tasted the wine way before we, or just before yes. we've made the, the sorbet. So, water in the bucket. Yeah. And now we are going to add the wine. The wine. We're going to can sugar. Now we've got the uh, the power tools. This is what every yes. guy loves. Yes. Sugar. Molecules and particles of sugar get all mixed with the wine. What are we testing for? We're testing the sugar oh, content. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. Why do we need to add? So you got a refractometer. Yes. Yeah, which we're using um, viticulture. Yes, you use yeah. the same for the viticulture. Yeah. And now we go and test whether we need to add a little bit more water or yeah. a little bit more sugar. Yeah. Okay. So what what uh, measurement are you looking for? Just the sugar. Bricks. Yeah, the bricks. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So see, so you put that onto there. This is what you would do. You would normally kind of crush a grape on there. Yep. Yeah. Close that. Yes. And then and you then look through there, just like his. And I don't know whether we'll be able to get that so that we can actually see it. Because that's the I fun don't think part. you can see it. Don't, don't you? No. So we have a bricks of 23, 24. It's, okay. it's lower than Fiasco in the others. Yeah. Probably the... Can I have a, see if I can see? Yes, you can. Can you show? Oh, yeah, there. That's interesting, isn't it? So we're just pouring this in the machine now. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Ten minutes later and we're here and we're, we're just... Wow. I have never seen sorbet coming out like that. I've never seen sorbet being made, actually. <laughs> it's actually very funny. It's like a big, fluffy, kind of cloud-type thing. The color, the color is different. Did you see? Yeah, yeah. This is a bit creamier. Yes, it's creamier, and I would say even whiter than the butter itself. Yeah, it must be. Oh my lord! Look at. And I would say it. we are ready. We are ready. I am pretty damned excited about this. Um, it looks like a bit of fiasco. You remember fiasco in the yeah, beginning? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Completely different. Yeah, very, very different. So now it's smooth. It's smooth. I don't see the citrus anymore. The lime is gone. Oh, so I know I still get a hint of lime for you me. See? Yeah. I see lots of passion fruit coming out. Even You're bound to find passion in everything. Everything? Yeah. Mango as well, a little bit of mango. What's the water you use? Just 
just like beer changes because of different types of water. Yes. Yeah. Anyway. It's a divine cup of sorbet. Divine cup of sorbet. That's, your, that's so. there your final words. Yeah. <laughs> um, I can now appreciate everything in your store. Because you. we made a fairly easy one relative to yes. what else is there. Yes. Thank you, Jason. Thank you for coming. It's oh, beautiful. Yeah, yeah. And um, we'll see you on the next episode of Wine Belt TV. Yes.